Hello, everyone. We've got some great news. The Voxta Cloud is finally here. It's designed specifically for Voxta and making it super simple for you to use all our AI services without needing any high-end hardware. Today, I'm here to walk you through setting it up. So let's dive in and get your Voxta Cloud up and running. Before we get into the setup, it's important to mention that Voxta Cloud uses a credit system, which is key to accessing all its features. These credits are available through our Patreon tiers. If you're looking to engage regularly with Voxta's AI characters, picking a tier that aligns with your usage will ensure you always have enough credits to keep the conversations going. Another key point to remember as we set up Voxta Cloud is how our credit system works alongside our Patreon tiers. If you find yourself running out of credits before your billing period ends, there's an easy fix. You can simply move up to the next higher tier to refill your credits instantly. However, it's important to note that when you upgrade, you won't receive a full tank of credits as described for the new tier. Instead, because Patreon only charges the difference when you upgrade, not the full amount, you'll receive a proportional increase in your credits. Now that we understand how the credits and Patreon tiers work, let's move on to actually setting up Voxta. The first step is to download the latest version of Voxta, you can always find the most recent build in the Voxta portal. But remember, to access this portal and download Voxta, you need to have an active Patreon subscription. For this tutorial, we'll be focusing on the Windows version. Once you've downloaded the Voxta server for Windows, it's time to unzip it. But a word of caution here. Choose your directory wisely. Avoid locations with security restrictions something straightforward like the main directory of your C or D drive. This avoids security restriction issues. Keep the folder structure straightforward and avoid white spaces in the folder names. Also, refrain from creating nested folders with repetitive names. Simplicity is key in your folder structure to avoid any technical hiccups. Upon launching Voxta, you will be greeted by the user profile setup screen. Simply input your name and description. This is how your AI companion will know your name and some basic information about you. Make sure you agree to the terms and conditions and also confirm that you are an adult. Press the Save and Get Started button to move forward with the setup process. You've now reached the wizard setup screen for Voxta. This is where you'll configure the essential services required to run Voxta effectively. These include text generation, text-to-speech, speech-to-text, action inference, and summarization services. You might consider using some online services. However, it's important to be aware that while this is an option, some of these services can be quite expensive. Additionally, managing them requires creating and handling multiple accounts, which can add to the complexity. You might decide to go local instead, but it's important to note that running these services locally requires a very powerful graphics card or a powerful CPU with lots of memory. But hey, there's good news. With Voxta Cloud, all of these services are covered. This means you don't need to worry about having high-end hardware or managing multiple accounts for different online services. Voxta Cloud takes care of everything, ensuring you can focus on creating and interacting without any hardware limitations. Click the Select button followed by the Continue button. Now we're at the stage where we need to configure Voxta Cloud to get everything up and running. The first thing we need is an API key. Here's how we do it. First, we'll navigate back to the Voxta portal. Look for the button labeled Generate API Key. Clicking this will create your unique key, which is crucial for connecting to Voxta Cloud services. It's incredibly important to securely store the API key you've copied. Once you navigate away from the page, there's no way to recover it. So make sure you save it somewhere safe. After you have your API key, return to the Voxta setup wizard. Here, you'll see a field where you can paste your API key. Go ahead and paste it, then click on Save and Install Service. With Voxta Cloud configured to handle services like text generation, text to speech, and more, we can simply skip all other steps related to service configuration. Voxta Cloud takes care of it. And there you have it. You are now ready to use Voxta. Hit Finish button. 
From the Start screen, you will be able to select and talk directly to Voxta or with the characters you have created. Out of the box, Voxta comes with three characters. The default Voxta personality, Catherine, and George. One important thing to remember is that within Voxta Cloud, the text-to-speech service, or what we refer to as character voices, can vary in cost. Currently, Voxta Cloud offers two types of voices, one set from Eleven Labs and another from Unreal Speech. The voices from Eleven Labs can be quite expensive, so keep that in mind. On the other hand, Unreal Speech offers voices that are of decent quality and much more affordable. By the way, if you like my voice, you can find it under the name Voxta underscore Bella. To help you manage your credit use effectively, Voxta Portal includes tools for monitoring your spending. In the portal, you can access the model's pricing and your usage history. The service usage chart is particularly useful. It allows you to filter by service type, giving you a clear overview of your activity and how much credits each service is consuming. This feature ensures you stay informed about your credit usage, helping you make cost-effective decisions about which services to use and when. So, make sure to keep an eye on your usage history to optimize your Voxta Cloud experience. Before we dive into chatting with our characters, there's another crucial element we need to explore, the Voxta menu. The Voxta menu acts as the central hub for all your needs, providing quick access to various services and settings. This is where you can fine-tune your experience, adjusting options for different services like speech transcription, voice, text generation, and more. Since we're leveraging Voxta Cloud for all our services, it's essential to ensure that all chat services are set to Voxta Cloud within the Voxta menu. This step is key to streamlining your interaction and ensuring that everything runs smoothly through the cloud. Hi, Echo. Hi, how are you doing today? Hmm. I'm doing great, thanks for asking. Just hanging out, waiting for my next command. How about you? What's on your mind today? And just like that, everything is working perfectly. You can now chat naturally using your voice with your unrestricted AI companion. Before we wrap up this tutorial, there's one more essential aspect we need to talk about, security and privacy. While we're not a big company, but rather a passionate team spread across the globe, your privacy and security are our top priorities. We're dedicated to creating something cool that you can trust. Here at Voxta, we promise to protect your data with the utmost care. We do not sell your data to anyone, and we follow strict security procedures to keep your usage of Voxta Cloud confidential. Our goal is to be as transparent as possible about how we handle your information. While we're committed to ensuring your privacy, we also encourage you to protect yourself by not sharing any sensitive information, like passwords or personally identifiable details, not just with us, but anywhere online. This advice holds true even when dealing with large companies that make big promises about security and privacy. Thank you for choosing Voxta and supporting this project.